this is how I'm explaining to myself what generative AI is in a way that I can wrap my head around it. So imagine the game show Family Feud or in Spanish, 50 Mexicanos dijeron, but instead of polling 50 people to see what the mass majority answered, imagine that you polled everything ever that anybody put on the internet until 2021 or almost anything ever, plus any books you could find. And what it's doing, it's predicting the most likely thing that would be said word by word. And then the generative part of this is that just like when a five-year-old figures out how to attach two Legos, then they know that they can continue attaching Legos. So they build like a more and more interesting Lego toy. That's what the generative part of the AI is. I did not get this explanation from ChatGPT. This is actually me as an AI architect really understanding what's going on here and uh, my nine years of experience teaching kindergarten, elementary school. Lastly, please don't be offended that I call this, explain it to me like I'm stupid. In case you didn't get the memo, we're all stupid compared to AI now. The world just changed. This is the biggest sleep humankind has made. All we can try to do is just not go crazy. This is me not going crazy.